Pre-wedding photos are important process in Chinese weddings. Today, Ya Wen and Ji Ming are getting ready for the perfect wedding photo that will present at their wedding reception dinner, which were held five months later. The preparation starts at 8 a.m. The photo studio offers a package of clothes and other services, including a makeup artist to help her do the makeup. The entire package costs 7,000 yuan, equal to one month of salary for Ya Wen. Here's the thing, both of us haven't taken much photos recently, and we hope these pictures can be kept for a very long time. After doing makeup for three hours, they only have ten minutes for a quick lunch. The actual shooting starts in the afternoon. The couple make four costume changes in total. It is the longest time they spend on taking photos in their seven years relationship. By the time they finish shooting, it's almost 8 p.m. Two weeks later, Ya Wen receives the sample photos. There was a time when Dreaming was posing for a photo by himself, an individual one. When I saw it outside, from the perspective of an observer, I thought it would be a good four-figure photo. But when we got the final version, it was only a headshot of Dreaming. It's not that different from what I imagined. Firstly, I thought the photographer had a separate film studio, but unexpectedly we finished it at their office. We planned to choose five costumes, but fortunately we only used four because it was so tiring by the end. And they are not the only couple who feel tired about pre-wedding photos. Here is Xiamen, a coastal city famous for tourism. On a sunny day, couples gathered on a beach some even waiting for two hours to get the perfect shot. Photographers can be very strict as well, especially on poses. For ordinary people, if they have good perception, they don't have to follow the routine. But for most people, they need more instructions. They need a shortcut, a pattern to make their photos look nice and high quality. And this is how every newlywed remembers this tiring memory. <laughs>